We are back and we love the recent snowfall, but it's not just because of the powder skiing and riding that the skiers and snowboarders can do. It's very important for the state of Colorado. Snow is a big factor in our ecology. We're going to learn more about this. We have Marshall Coles with us now and he's with Walking Mountains. Good to see you again. Hello, good to see you too. Well, what a perfect time to bring this up because we did get some new snow on Beaver Creek Mountain, mm -hmm. eight inches new, four over at Vail and more earlier this week. And that's just good news, not only for right now, but for the rest of the year. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah, our snowpack is very important here in Colorado, um, even more so than uh, many of the other states, especially out in the east. So. Mm -mm. And part of the reason that is, is because Colorado is actually kind of an arid state. Mm -hmm. Yep, it's semi-arid state. Not much rainfall, so. Yeah, mm -hmm. we've received quite a bit less than the national average, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Vail has an average annual precipitation of about uh, 14 and a half inches of rain every year, and um, that's 63% less than what um, the national average is. So we really don't get a lot of rainfall. So it's the snow that we rely on so much. Yeah, that surprises me because we do get those afternoon showers in the summer, almost uh, predictable mm -hmm. at a predictable rate. But even with that, it's still not enough. Yeah, they move through pretty quickly. You yeah. know, they're just those short thunderstorms with some showers. Okay. But, uh, yeah. And how is our snowpack looking this year? Are we pacing for average? Um, yeah, we could either be a little bit above, a little bit below, right around average. Um, we started out really well in November and then um, we had February, which was really low. So we've kind of had some ups and downs this whole year. So um, we could be yeah, somewhere around average or maybe a little below, but um, a little above too, so yeah. we'll have to see how it plays out. Yeah, some of the stats here, average snowfall is 354 inches. Mm -hmm. Right now, we're about at 266, yep. and we still have some season left, and it's exactly, been nice yeah. that Mother Nature has been cooperating this week. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's been good, so get out there and enjoy the snow. Okay. Now, Colorado yeah. is also known as the Headwater State, mm -hmm. so that's another reason why this snowpack is important. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so um, we have some very major rivers that we are the source to, um, where they all originate, and that would be like the Colorado, where um, we're in the Colorado watershed yeah. here in Vail, so that's the big one for us. But um, we also hold the Arkansas, the North and South Platte, um, the Rio Grande, um, so yeah, just many, many rivers that start here. So. Um, all of our rivers are, for the most part, fed by that snowpack that melts. Yeah, it's amazing. Them, yep, so. the Colorado headwater is just north of here, Arkansas just south of here. Mm -hmm. I didn't know about the Rio Grande. Mm -hmm. That's really cool yeah. that that originates so. in the state of Colorado, too. Yeah. So. And I've always heard that Colorado, you know, a lot of the water that we have here provides water for many, many states out to the west and mm -hmm. southwest of us, too. Yeah, exactly. Like the Colorado, there's seven states that um, kind of rely on that, that feed into it. and. Uh, um, we're just one of the main ones as well. So okay. um, a good snow year is really important for, well, for everyone in the West. And it's also important for recreation. Any of the snow that's going to melt off then becomes wonderful for whitewater rafting, Absolutely. kayaking, mm -hmm. huge industries here, yeah. and for fishing. Mm -hmm. Yep. So, uh, yeah, it's good for everyone all year round. Okay, so mm -hmm. pray for snow, do the snow dance. When we see the <laughs> snow come down, it really is the white gold, and we do love it, but it's cool to get these stats. Once again, Colorado receives about 63% less moisture uh, than less rainfall than the national average. So when it snows, we're definitely happy about it. You can learn more about Walking Mountains programs, their science behind, their free snowshoe hikes. You can find it all at walkingmountains.org. We have Rick Mesmer standing by outside. He's going to let us know what the weather is, and then we have Hour number two and another giveaway coming up.